Hey you guys, what's up? This old MPS here bring you a brand new review. This review is for Suicide Winner. Uh, he's actually a good friend of mine. And I'm here to review his three, what I assume is his three best maps. His first map is uh, City Map. Uh, I found actually a ton of glitches in this map, which I really didn't like. These little things right here, the circles to turn around, those are very poorly forged. I would definitely change that. When you're trying to make someone do uh, reverse, try to make it a little bit larger of an area, more of a berm to go around. Another thing is, is that, I don't know why he always has that shield door there. I guess that's his, uh, his little uh, thing that he puts in all of his maps as his, uh, what's it called, Easter egg. But at that one part was pretty confusing. I couldn't exactly figure out where to go for the cannon man. And I'm pretty sure, I, I mean, I caught it pretty early because I was like, wait a second, where's the hell the checkpoint at? Then I realized, oh wait, I'm going the wrong way. Another thing is, is that that once again another turnaround that's really bad. Uh, this part's a little bit neat. I like this part better, but you know, just could have been done better. Uh, this part right here, I really I hate these things where the rocks are just randomly placed down on the ground. Why do you have that there? What's the point of that? I mean, it's not really adding anything to the the, uh, the map. It's just kind of slowing you down. Uh, this is the second map. I, uh, it's called Belmont's Big Checkpoint Dipper, I'm pretty reached. sure. It's actually based off of a real roller coaster. Checkpoint that is uh, wooden, actually. I, I went ahead and watched a video of it because I just looked it up. But uh, it's, it's very close to it, actually. I was rather surprised with it. I liked it. But, you know, once Checkpoint again, it's got reached. his basic problems. Kind of makes it... I mean, I, I bet you if I raced this a hundred times, I could go fast-paced on it. But really, it, it feels more like a slow-paced roller coaster. He has a lot of parts that don't, doesn't just doesn't seem to work you know he has this little part up here which you know I, I have respect for him and then he has a shield door slowing Check you down even reach. more but here you know you kinda go down this weird little thing I didn't like that too much it's just an awkward feeling roller coaster man I mean one thing I have to give you credit though for is that you do have a wide variety of map creating skills You've created hundreds, of, well not hundreds, but quite a few. Ma okay, that cannon man there is evil. What the hell is that there for? I would have been fine without the cannon man. It almost freaking killed me. But once again, uh, I guess I was trying to make it more fast paced and another shield door to slow you down, even though it's trying to keep you from jumping off the track. But one thing I have to admit with Suicide Winner is that you do. The thing I like the most about you is that you're an everywhere forger. You can forge roller coasters, you can forge other maps. You're just a very talented uh, forger. But, you know, you need to find an area that you're particularly good at. This is uh, Next Trap, point five oh. This is a very original track. This is my favorite out of the three. This is actually a really short review. It's only like a five-minute review. But the problem that I found with this track is, is that it's a little bit too uh, challenging, I guess, to say. I mean, I die so many times on this map. But I decided to go ahead and put it down because I figured that's more time for me to talk. Anyway, the map's good. I like it pretty original. I've never seen anybody do a uh, half of Y that's also a challenge coaster. I really like Checkpoint. it's pretty original. I like how he's got the cones there to let you know that oh crap you're about to go into Checkpoint. another half wide. Reach. It's challenging. It's a short track and the thing I like about it is that it's all into this little Checkpoint. section so it's very compiled but once again Reach. just it feels like an awkward roller coaster you know it doesn't feel right like some turns were too quick to off key the jumps aren't straightforward. It's just an awkward. I mean, most of his maps are that way. I hate to say it, Suicide Winner, but your maps are just kind of awkward. I mean, you're a great forger, no doubt. You're way better than I am. Sorry. But, uh. Wow, sorry, I got a bubble in my throat. But, uh, the thing with this is that, you know, okay, first off, that was kind of weird. I'm pretty sure I was supposed to go faster than that, and the rock saved my butt there. But it's just, you know, I, I really like your maps. You're a very original forger, but you need to find out what your strength is. I still feel like you're you're lost. I like I picked your two roller coasters because I couldn't find another map that I liked of yours on your file share. But just go ahead and pick a drain like Arlde Hatamali roller coaster. And that rock there is evil. Why did it kill me? I just barely touched it. I would've been fine. But like I said. Try to find out what your strength is. Try to find out what your best at is. Are you amazing Slayer map maker or is roller coasters your best? Just choose your main variety. So for your rating, 
I, I, I'm gonna give you a six out of ten. I'm sorry. I know it's kind of a cruel rating for you, but really try to find out what you're good at, and then just expand on it as much as possible. All right, it's Olympia signing out. See ya.